Hey, what's going on guys? It's Lee McCall here. And today I wanted to ask you guys a question. Do you see anything out of the ordinary here? Well, probably so because you saw the title of the video. I am using a Palsy Buff Octobox on my Flashpoint Explorer without any like ghetto rigging going on here. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. Here we go. All right guys, so as you can see, I've got the modifier right here and I'm just gonna go ahead and undo that. There is a Bowens S-Type adapter right there in the middle of that speed ring. And you guys can go to adorama.com, cmes.com. I'm gonna post the URL in the description of this video where you can purchase this adapter. And all you have to do is undo these metal screws right here. There's four of them. There's three, one more. And then you will see these plastic washers. And that is what allows it to turn. And I'm just going to go ahead and take out the top washer on all four of these bolts. There is the adapter right there. It is the same exact size as the original Palsy Buff adapter that goes in there and um, it literally just fits. Some people have been getting different variations of these and you can see that I actually filed down just a little bit of that tab just to make it a little bit easier when I put it in there but this worked as soon as I got it out of the box. These actually rotate as well guys so I am able to use the soft box just like I was with my regular Paul C. Buff Einsteins. So I'm just gonna put those metal washers back in. You're gonna place those screws back. And you guys can see right there, that is how you mount the Bowens S-mount adapter to a Paul C. Buff modifier. And when you're ready to mount it back on the light, you just set it in there. You give it a little twist. 